Hello dear friend and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Is your laptop or your PC running very slowly? Especially when you are using Windows 10? Then this video is recommended for you so that you can be able to know how you can be able to make your computer or your laptop run much faster. So without wasting much time, let us get started. So the first thing that you need to do to be able to make your machine run faster is by doing some cleanup on your disk or on your computer to make sure that it runs faster. The first step, clean temporary files from your computer. So for you to do that, click on start and type run, then select here, run, then type temp for temporary, then click OK. It will need administrator's permission to continue, just click continue. After it has opened, there will be so many files down here, which are temporary files. As you know, Windows, key, uh, Windows 10 keeps temporary files. So what you can do is just select all by Control A and click delete. These, some of them will require administrator's uh, permission to delete. Just click continue. Then you can see we have deleted around 180, uh, 180 MBs. Then, if you come across such a such an option, just click, uh, mark this and click skip. After that, close this and come back. We are not yet done with the temporary files. Uh, again, type percentage, type run first, then click OK. Then type percentage, temp, then percentage, then click enter then you will again run to this folder where again Windows 10 keeps temporary, uh, temporary files then just uh, select all and also delete them you can see also we have deleted around 200 MBs of files from this folder close this the next thing is that we are supposed to clean prefetch files also they are type of uh, temporary files that also windows keeps so open again type run enter <coughs> then type prefetch sorry prefetch then click enter then click continue then this will also open another folder whereby you have so many temporary files what you need to do is just select all and also click delete then we have deleted around we have deleted around 600 so far of temporary files the next thing is that we need to do something called disk cleanup so disk cleanup is a program that is inbuilt in uh, windows 10 that helps someone to delete unnecessary files in the computer so what you need to do just come here and type disk cleanup then click run as administrator then when it opens click select the disk that you want to run for me i'll start with the disk c first then click ok so when you click ok it should take you to the next step but this may take some few minutes because it will first of all start by calculating the size of your disk and also how much you have used from your disk after it has opened this is how it will look like so you can be able to select all the files that you want to delete from this and be able to delete them so for example you can delete we can select all of them unless there is a specific file that you don't want to delete for me i'm okay with deleting almost everything Also, you realize that recycle bin. Also, you realize that recycle bin has for 66 MBs of uh, data, so you have also to delete that. Then you can just click continue, and this will ask you if you are sure you want to permanently delete these files. Then just click delete. Then also, this will take some few more seconds to be able to complete. Just wait until it completes. So after that, it has done. So the next thing is that we need to clean uh, Windows update files, which are unnecessary in our computer. As you know, every time you update your Windows, 
the file uh, the windows uh, the drive c or local disk c shrinks or the uh, the space reduces so for you to be able to do that come to windows uh, to local disk c scroll down all the way where you have software distribution this one software distribution then select these files you can be able to see that these files as a, have occupied a lot of space in our computer that is around 707 uh, mbs so what you need to do is just select them and click delete then it will require some administrator's uh, permission just click continue and it will be able to delete so thank you so much for watching this video please if this is your first time here make sure you subscribe like and share this video and i'll be so much glad thank you